Hello, how's everyone doing? Um, it's been sort of a rainy day here. Not too cold, but raining. I guess that's the way it works. Low pressure, warmer, but wet. High pressure, nice weather, but cool. Yeah. So things are moving towards midterms next week. I have uh, my alternate room bookings booked. So we are uh, in larger rooms for all my classes. The rooms that my classes are in for all three of my classes are very small, especially for writing tests. I regularly do write have them write tests in those rooms, but I am aware that there might be some, you know, looking over the uh, desk to the next sheet, even if only accidentally. So uh, I figured for the midterm and for any finals, maybe a bigger room is a good idea. That's a little tricky because <coughs> they're all two hour bookings. I don't know about I don't know if the midterms are going to go that long. <laughs> I don't think so. But uh, I have to book that time anyway. So uh, they had a little trouble finding the rooms. But yeah, run all over the school and eventually you'll find a room that is empty. Some of them are pretty distant. But anyway, <coughs> my cough is not <clears throat> pleasing me. My printer, the toner cartridge is gone. We're going. So I have to print off school, which is annoying. It's okay at actually downtown. It's just fine there because I go to the computer lab, plug in my, my USB drive and that's it. But there are no computers with USB access in the office at uh, the college. It just happens that there are two very old computers sitting there, which they have to rectify because that's no good. Anyway, there's a computer lab there, but I wasn't going to go to that trouble, so I'll print it off tomorrow via my USB. I'm doing reviews with the students of all sorts of stuff so that they'll be prepared for the midterms. They should be okay. They're not tough midterms. But then, you know, I speak English, so I can say that. <coughs> That's starting to hurt. Yeah. I just felt like talking. Rambling, as Brad says. I believe that's what he said. Lots of stuff happened today, but... I had six hours of straight teaching. Two listening and speakings and one academic writing. All of my three classes today. And it's always interesting, as I've said before, <coughs> to see the first class in the morning of the listening and speaking and then the second section in the afternoon and how they handle everything. <sighs> Amazing how the first class just breezes through everything. second class does not breeze through everything. Ken was asking me about that today. He says, have you, you said you didn't really notice a difference in the two classes. Well, I guess in the listening and speaking, it is not so obvious. <coughs> the listening and speaking, they're 
fairly, well, no, they have a harder time. But the, in the writing, the class is fairly good. So the students that may have trouble with speaking and listening don't have so much trouble in the writing. So that's where I find that they balance out. Ken, on the other hand, has them for pronunciation and Canadian perspectives. And he finds that one class is incredibly stronger than the other. Whereas I see them, you know, balanced out. Whatever, whatever. I'm just uh, not in doing any kind of work mode, even though I came home and promptly did work. So obviously I just can't stop sometimes. I guess I should sit down and watch some television. Got the news on behind me. All sorts of political goings on. Interesting that both the American debates and the Canadian debates have been going on. And <coughs> we're seeing very similar or somewhat similar outcomes because the uh, liberal contingent here is very gradually moving upward and the conservative conservatives are moving ever so slightly down through oh actually the Canadians are being rather foolhardy the conservative is just one gaffe after another the American ones Obama seems to have come through the most recent debate <coughs> quite nicely. Whereas McCain just seems to be not making mistakes. I, I didn't watch them, but I haven't heard anything about any gaffes. But uh, he just seems to be staying level while Obama, Obama is on the up, upswing. That kind of uh, works for Canadians because liberals and Democrats work well together. As for conservatives and Republicans, huh, I'm not so sure, perhaps, but not the way that liberals and Democrats work together. So let's hope there's a match up there. That would be nice. Ah, oh, there's my son coming online. <coughs> I have to ask him about some stuff. Problems with a check. From Apple, by the way. Yeah. So I will uh, talk to you all some other time. Perhaps when I'm feeling better. Sheesh. Closer to Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving this weekend. Yay. That's where my husband is now going to get the turkey with his mom. That should be fun. I was just reading Facebook where uh, his nephew's girlfriend made a comment about coming this weekend, so it'll be nice. The whole family will be together. As we do every year at Christmas time. Christmas time, yeah. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, Easter, and Christmas as we get together. Good night folks. Have a good one. See you later.